Guys, it's starting to smell wicked in here. I need to light a candle. Ooh. Ooh, it stinks. another video and today's video I'm gonna be trying frozen meals now I'm well aware that my stomach's going to be in full shambles after this video so please pray for me but some of these meals I grew up on some of them you guys probably grew up on there's a lot of meals I have not tried in my life so let's just get into this um, this is my raw and real reaction so we're gonna just experience this together but like comment subscribe share this video with all your friends and let's get into it all right, we got all the frozen meals right here, guys. Let's see what we have on the menu. So first, let's start it off strong. Banquet. Whoever owns Banquet, you did your big one in my childhood because I was eating these after practice like it was my business. This is the Salisbury steak with gravy, mashed potatoes, cinnamon, apple dessert, and sweet corn. But I don't know if it tastes the same way I remember. So we're gonna see. Everything else I've never tried, so here we go. This is another banquet. This is spaghetti and meatballs. The meatballs are made with chicken, pork, and beef, and there's marinara sauce on top. Um, I'm a little nervous. You cannot mess up spaghetti, but this is frozen, so I'm not really sure. Let's see what y'all are giving. For the kids, we have a kid cuisine. This is popcorn chicken french fries, corn, and victory sprinkle brownie. Now, I didn't grow up eating kid cuisines, but a lot of my friends did. So, I don't know about that. Now, my dad told me to get a hungry man, so I'm guessing he grew up eating these. A roasted carved white meat turkey. And it comes with white meat turkey, mashed potatoes, gravy, mixed vegetables, seasoned stuffing, and apple dessert. This looks like a stomach ache actually waiting to happen. This looks disgusting. Look at the gravy. We have a Hot Pocket. I've never had a Hot Pocket in my life. My friends love Hot Pockets, but I'm like, this Hot Pocket says big and bold, so I'm bigging my back right now for you guys. You're welcome. This is the Chicken Bacon Ranch Hot Pocket. So it says creamy ranch, smoked bacon, and reduced fat mozzarella in a ranch blasted crust. That kind of sounds good. Last but not least, we have this spinach artichoke cheese dip from Fridays. We're gonna start with this because it gives appetizer. Let's just pop it open, see what the first impression is. Um, it looks like spinach artichoke dip. Cook on high for three minutes. Also, I have these chips, so that's what I'm gonna use to dip into my dip. All right, guys, it just beeped. It's already starting to smell bad. Ooh, it stinks. Wow, oh, that smells bad. It says, pull the film back. This is what it looks like so far. Just mix it up. This goes back in the microwave for two more minutes. I'm gonna need to wear a mask. <clears throat> this smells god awful. Let's just smell first. It smells like, it smells like I'm gonna be sick, honestly. I had to let it cool off a little bit because I picked this chip up and it was like piping hot. So let's get a fresh chip because that one's probably soggy. And here we go, raw and real review. We're just gonna take this. actually not bad. It kind of tastes just like it. Oh, this is good. I am not lying to you right now when I say this is actually good. Ooh. So when I was younger, there was no apple crust thing before. 
It was only the mashed potatoes, the corn, and the steak. They just added this apple stuff. I don't know what that is. But now the mashed potatoes and the steak are in the same compartment. This is the corn, and then this is the apple. Pull up a side of each thing, and let's hope for the best. This one, ooh, them apples stink. Ooh, this kind of stink. Oh, my stomach is getting weak, guys. This is still frozen. Oh my God. I guess we can give it a flip. Oh, that's nasty. I think the sauce is just combined together. Put it back in the microwave. I'm thinking I'm gonna heat this up while I let that one cool off when it's done. So this one, let's see what it looks like. Is it all separate? This is what it looks like. This one says microwave for three minutes on high. Smells a little interesting. But we're gonna just put that here so that it can cool off. This is what it looks like. I don't really know what to do right now. Look at it. Next, we're gonna make our hot pocket. We really smell. All right, no smell right now. Plate it, unwrap the sandwich and place it on a microwave safe plate. Boom. Then it says heat it. One sandwich is two minutes and 40 seconds. Let's do that. Oh, it stinks. Ew. What? Now we're gonna cook the kid cuisine. Take this out. What is that? Oh, this, it's supposed to come with the sprinkles packet. I feel ripped off. It's supposed to come with the sprinkles packet and I don't have a sprinkles packet. But we're gonna put this in the microwave for four minutes. This, no. This smells God awful, oh my gosh. All right, so five minutes, it's going in. Guys, it's starting to smell wicked in here. I need to light a candle. Oh, no. It says to stir. All right, guys, so we have all our food cooked. This is the steak, the spaghetti and meatballs, the hot pocket, the hungry man, the kid cuisine, and the spinach artichoke dip. We're gonna start trying all of this food. I'm very nervous. Salisbury steak. There's mashed potatoes. This is supposed to be gravy. We're just gonna go into it. I used to like this. I don't know if I still will, but let's just try everything one at a time. So first we have the steak. I used to do this. I used to take the corn, put it on this side. A little bit of mashed potatoes, a little bit of corn, a little bit of steak. I mean, it gets the job done. I think I like this. Ooh. Apple dessert. Here we go. Oh my God, it's juicy. Apple dessert. Ready? Ooh, I'm scared. <laughs> Ugh, ew. No. No. Solid no to the apple dessert. I always just leave that there and keep it moving. That is disgusting. They could have left that out. Banquet. I'd like to write an email. That is disgusting. Do not ever put that apple stuff in there again. That is my fork is I need a new fork. Next we have the spaghetti. We're just, we're going with big bites because I'm actually trying to try it for y'all. Let's just go for it, ready? One, two, three. Let's try a meatball. It's 
edible. Um, there's just no flavor to this. Like, let me try to get some hot sauce. Let's try this with some hot sauce. Cause I really want to enjoy this. You know what I mean? Like, okay, let's see. Okay. I'm tasting a little more flavor with the hot sauce. The hot sauce is kind of helping. Without the hot sauce, five out of 10. With the hot sauce, seven out of 10. Chicken, bacon, ranch, hot pocket. Smells like Chuck E. Cheese pizza. That's what it smells like. All right, let's give it a bite. Mm -mm. I don't think I can swallow. No. 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 It's a no for me. No. This deserves jail time. This is disgusting. I hate this. I hate this. This is gross. This is the worst thing I've ever put in my mouth. Like, this needs to be canceled, discontinued, all of the above. Guys, I have to get up close and personal. All jokes aside, I've never had a Hot Pocket in my life. And right now my taste buds are mad at me. That was foul. That was terrible. Two more things to try. Is my stomach gonna make it? The world may never know. French fries or mashed potatoes? Cause look at that. Yep. Oh guys. I found the sprinkles. The french fries are very, very soggy. Let's try this chicken. Chicken feels a little crunchier. Okay. If I was a kid, I could stomach this. That's not bad. Zero flavor to the corn. That's not gonna get the kids to eat the vegetables. The sprinkles on the cake. Let's try the cake. Does it just come out? Oh yeah, so the sprinkles just don't even stick. I can't swallow. Ah! Oh God. It tastes exactly how it smells. Dirt. The chicken, for it to be frozen, let's be real, this is actually pretty good chicken. So I'll rate the chicken a seven. Everything else on this plate, one. One, I rate it a one. Moving along. I saved this for last because I, I'm the most nervous about this one, honestly. I don't think I'm prepared for this. Mashed potatoes, let's just go around the world on this one. Is something. Ugh, I don't even like stuffing. Oh God. <laughs> ah. That stuffing tastes like, it tastes like soggy croutons. That turkey. Oh, it's splashed everywhere. It tastes like sandwich meat. That's gross. Let's try some mashed potatoes and gravy. No, no, some carrots. It's a vegetable. Let's try some green beans. Ah. Oh. All right, this is the last thing we have to try and then I'm done. This freaking apple custard thing. And this one looks even worse, guys. Look at this. Oh! Uh -uh. So just to look back one more time, this, you know, since I grew up on it, it gives. This with hot sauce, she gives. This is a 10 out of 10. Don't walk, run. This is a good little appetizer snack. You can give this to your kids for the chicken, nothing else. You're probably not gonna get the best parent award for this meal right here. But, you know, if it's just a fast day and you need to give your kids something to eat, this will do. Illegal, jail time. 
and this just simply needs to be discontinued. All right, guys, so that about wraps up this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Like, comment, subscribe, share this video with all your friends, and let me know in the comment section down below what frozen foods you guys grew up on or which ones you guys want me to try next. See you guys in the next one. Bye. Hi, I